everyone's Karen. Um, I had a couple of things to talk about today. First, I've been getting a lot of um, questions um, about what's going on with uh, Crafter's Companion. And the only thing I know is kind of what everybody else is saying online about um, apparently their um, designer, Sheena, she designs a lot of their stamps and embossing folders. And apparently over the past few days, they have been finding out that her um, stamps and everything were directly copied from other people's artwork. Um, I've seen the pictures and there's no two ways about it. That's what's happening. And um, I, as far as what I've heard, and I really don't know this for definite, but because she had stolen the um, photos from other people that by using her stamps and, and bought, oh, I guess just the stamps basically, because that's what you'd see, um, you're basically also committing fraud to a point if you use them and sell them because it is not her work, it's whoever the artist was that she had taken the work from, if that makes sense. Um, so I don't know if we can send our stuff back to Crafter's Companion or wherever it was purchased from. I, I just honestly don't know and I don't want to spread false rumors about what can be done, should be done. This is just what I've been hearing um, online and you know from people who know about it. But um, they were talking about that you cannot use anything and then sell it to anyone for any, like you can't, I don't think you can even sell your dies because they are direct copy you know we have all the stamps and dies that match so the whole thing you can't really sell it because then you're selling things that didn't belong to the direct artist in which these things came from so the other question was what's going on with the um monthly boxes the kits and we all whoever you know got them from hsn um i got a message that said that my circles die set would be um, late, that it wasn't gonna be there on time, and I had no idea what they were talking about. So I called, finally figured out that they were talking about the kit for this month, so which should be number seven, but it's now called the die cutting, circle die cutting kit. And the only thing that I can think of what held it up was maybe that there was some of Sheena's stuff that was going to be in box number seven and the reason that they didn't send it out was because they couldn't send out more stuff that she had done um the other reason would be they were just dealing with all this and things just got out late from what other people are saying that it was possible that her stuff was in the box and they could not send it so it took a while to redo the box and i do not know that for sure that is just what i've been hearing so if you have any questions, you know, just send them to me. But I really, yeah, I really don't know. But I did get my box today and I'll put you down and we'll go through it. Okay, so this is it. Circle die cuts. And I have to say that I am not very happy with this box, but you guys judge for yourself. It's always just as pretty as it always is. And it always comes with a bazillion envelopes and cards and that's what these are same regular same stuff we get every month the stamps which are the same basic stuff we get every month with the butterflies and the flowers and let's see if this helps there you go i mean they're pretty flowers pretty butterflies but I just every time i get it it's the same thing so it also came with really pretty little um, half pearls that are sticky on one side. Came with the ribbon to go with them. Really pretty. Um, well, this is the circle dies that they're talking about being. This is what the box is called circle. It's exactly called Circle die cutting. Now to me, there's a lot of stuff in here that we get every month and 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight circles. They're very, very thin. They really, are, you could bend them very, very easily. And I think if you're gonna call something a circle die kit, this would be the star of the kit. And I don't see that. I mean, yep, they're circles and I'm sure they will go right through your die cutting machine, but, but that's what they're sending with, along with the envelopes and the cards and everything we get every month. So I was kind of holding out for the Christmas that I thought would come, but Christmas didn't come. I really thought that this month's kit was gonna be some Christmas stuff that we could, um, you know, make for cards and whatnot, but new. No. All right, so these are some of the uh, sticker die, I think they're sticker. No, they're just die cut, so they're not stickered. And they're all special gift to a special friend. And happy birthday. Like, nothing to go with the circles. Like, you would think this would all match up to some circles, but it does not. And it's very pretty. I mean, it's always very pretty. It's just always the same thing. And then you get your basic cardstock, which matches everything else. And it's not really cardstock, it's paper, I guess. I think they call it cardstock, but it's, it's not, it's paper. And then there's always the printed paper. And it's, I mean, I like it. It's pretty good. There are three of each. So there's three of each. So then there's three of this. And then there is, oh, still that. Three of this. Three of the pink. This is pretty with the peachy, orangey kind of color. And there's this. And that's it. And again, it's, it's all very pretty. It's all pretty. I just find myself coming a little um, disillusioned by Crafter's Companion. Um, like I said, I don't know what they're going through because I mean, that must have been horrifying for Sarah to find out what was happening with her top designer. And I really feel for her because she's just made this company since she was in college, which is amazing. And um, like I say, I've got a ton of her stuff and I love it, but I can go up now so I can talk. Um, but I really honestly did think that there was gonna be Christmas. I mean, it's Christmas. <laughs> like there's no Christmas. And like I say, to, to name something the die cutting circle and i know people weren't happy last month with the aqua markers and there were three and i mean i get it it's a sampling of what she has and what she's selling and um like i i love this stuff i just i don't need what they're sending so maybe the subscription box is not for me maybe i should just buy and pick what i want um but I just really thought that Christmas was coming and it didn't. So leave me a message. Um, happy to answer anybody's questions. And um, like I said, so I hope you like your box. And I mean, they're great products, but basically we got cards and envelopes, paper, and um, eight little thin, very thin circle die cuts. So, like I say, I really don't know any of the answers. This is all like just me repeating and giving my thoughts on what happened. Um, sorry, my dog has decided that this is the exact time she'd like to sit here. So, um, yeah. So, let me know what you think of the kit. Let me know if you've gotten yours yet. And, um, yeah, I'd be happy to answer any questions. So, I hope you guys have a great night. And I will be back on with another video. Um, I was in the middle of doing it and everything died. And now everybody's going to be coming home for dinner. So um, I don't like videotape when they're here.
first of all, we have three dogs and they will go crazy as soon as people get here. So, um, oh, I had a quick question. Does anybody have the We Are Memory Keepers laser ruler system thingamahiggy? Um, I bought one and I love it because I do a lot of um, calligraphy and brush, brush lettering and the laser is awesome. You don't have to use the lines and um, and then a few days after using it, one side of the laser, laser stopped working and then I got a new one. They sent me it yesterday. I put the batteries in and one side doesn't work again. <laughs> I'm like, just wonder if that's happened to anyone, but I'll put a video out asking that question so that people who actually have it could answer me. So anyway, um, yeah, so good luck with your kits and um, I'll talk to you again soon.